In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to share a Google form as an editor with others. This can be incredibly useful when you are collaborating on gathering information, feedback or data collection with your team or colleagues. Let's dive right in. First, you'll want to start by navigating to Google Drive. If you're unfamiliar, you can find it by simply typing Google Drive into your web browser's search bar or by entering drive.google.com. This is the central hub where all your Google Forms, along with other documents, are stored. Once you're on Google Drive, you're on your way to sharing your form. Next, within Google Drive, take a look at the top left corner and you'll notice an option that says Apps. Click on it. This is where you can see a suite of applications available to you, which includes Forms, Sheets, Docs and more. Clicking Apps will open a list so you can go ahead and select Forms. Once you've clicked on Forms, you will see a list of all the forms that you have created. Browse through your list and select the specific form you want to share. Make sure it's the exact form you need because this is the moment when you specify access for another person. Click on the form to open it. Now look towards the top right of your screen. Here you will see a button labelled Share. Click on it. This step is essential because it opens up the sharing settings for your selected form. Initially, the sharing settings might be set to Restricted, which means only people you add can have access. To change this setting, click on Restricted. A drop-down menu will appear, and you want to select anyone with the link. This change allows anyone who has the link to access the form, which is quite handy for broader collaboration. After setting the access to anyone with the link, it's time to share the link itself. Look for the option Copy Responder Link. Click on that, and the link will be copied to your clipboard. This is the link you will send to the person you want to collaborate with. Once you've copied the link, go ahead and click Done to exit the sharing settings. Completing this action finalises the settings you've chosen. The final step is to send the copied link to the other person. You can paste and send it to them via email, chat or any other communication method you prefer. And that's it, you've successfully shared your Google Form as an editor. I hope you found this tutorial helpful, making collaboration on Google Forms easier and more efficient. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.